Hey, worship after worship. Eh? Welcome, welcome, my people. Welcome to Shekinah World, a product of Shekinah International Ministries. Hey, we are, we are educated, we are empowered, and we are enlightened. Hey, by the word of Yeshua Halmashiach, the word that changes us, the word that transforms us. Hey, welcome, welcome. Let us worship God. Let us thank Him. Let us give Him all the glory that He deserves. If not for God, hey, where would we have been? Hmm. Let us give Him glory. Let us give Him honor. Hey, Daddy, we appreciate you. Happy as you are, man. I call that you are Shadow. Daddy, we thank you, sir. We give you glory, we give you honor, we give you adoration, sir. Hey, in you we live, in you we move, in you we have our being. I just want you to be a bow. I want to be a Yes, Lord, make way, make way for me. Neighbor, Bang 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 bang, eh? I could I shut down, eh? I could read it for bang 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 bang, eh? Got this glory, ah yeah, got this vanity. Eh, you love my glory, oh boy. Hey, our life we done better because of you, daddy. Hey. Hallelujah, somebody. Yes. Then they call you a Jebata or Moboti. Eh? 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 Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. The point, Mimimo. Oh, my so kind of say you are. You look at your baba. So much, dear Mimimo. Hey, yes, you are. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Happy day, me. Olaoba. God bless you. More anointing, more grace in the name of Jesus. I'm always happy when I see our youth, you know, jumping up, dancing, and, 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 and being crazy for, for Jesus. Because it's always good to catch you guys young so you can serve your maker. Uh, I'm so happy. I'm so proud of you guys. God bless you. Uh, welcome everyone to Shekinah again. Uh, this is a Monday Bible study, and I know that our mommy, Mama Wati Wankale, our mommy is already here. She's uh, she's been doing this series, and we have been blessed. And I I pray that you and I will continue to be blessed in the name of Jesus. Welcome, ma. More grace, ma. More more anointing, ma. Hey. You will not do it in vain in the name of Jesus. You will be handsomely, handsomely, and beautifully rewarded. 
In the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. So thank you all. Please uh, continue to join us and continue to share. And uh, God will bless you too. Amen. Over to you, ma. Uh, Father and our God, we just want to thank you. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Holy One of uh, Israel will worship you. We have come again to give you all the glory. We have also come again tonight to learn at your feet. My Father, my God, we know that you are the best teacher. And we know that we have prepared. You have already prepared for us to teach us. Spirit of the living God, we thank you. Thank you for what you will do in our life tonight in the name of Jesus. Thank you for your daughter that you have been using to bless us. Daddy, you will reward her, you will replenish her, and you will enrich her in all areas of our life. Amen. 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 Last week, we talked about um, this is the third one, I think it's the third edition of this one. Yes. Because the Lord told us that the uh, purpose is in month of love. Hmm. And I want to testify that the love has, love, lots of love has been shown to you in this. Uh, Amen. Um, Me too. <laughs> As God, you are just you are faithful. Yes, you know? our God is faithful. When I think of something, He does something. He, he does, does it. Me too. <laughs> this month, mm. people have shown me love in a surprising ah, way. Thank you, Lord. So, it's not in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 They will give you opportunity to even show more love to Amen. others. Amen. Amen. That's why God created us mm. to help one another. Yes. So when we started this series, we said we want to find out. Where in the Bible, where human beings showed love mm. to fellow human beings yes. for nothing, not because okay, mm. I will show you love because you are my wife or you are my daddy, you are mm. my mother or yes. yes, because of who you are, mm. you know, and that is the agape love, the love of God that you are shared abroad mm. in our hearts. So, so many scriptures um, today we have. Um, yes, last week we finished um, after after finishing with the. We struggle, the first week, we struggle to fish out 20 in the Bible. Okay, yeah. And it's such a big shame. Because if we are talking about Jesus showing love in so many. Mm. But for human beings showing love to one another, we struggle to fish out 20. Mm. Finally did. So the following week, that's exactly Sunday, Monday, what we did was that um, we now took each one of them, we got up to number 11, yeah. each one of them, and gave a realistic and personal example mm. and also analysis of that thing mm. as we put them. So today um we are going to start from number twelve. Okay. Last week earlier with Dockers and the women. Remember? Yes, yes. Yeah. And then this week we are going to finish it up from number twelve. Okay. The rich woman and Elijah or Elisha. Yeah, the rich from woman and Elisha. Mm-hmm. That rich woman, you know, we're not going to that's that other time we read all the scriptures. We read some today. Okay. That rich woman who whenever Elijah came to uh the town, she now decided, okay, instead of this man, I don't know where he sleeps. Let him come and be sleeping in our house. Mm. And the attic of the house she made a very nice bedroom for him. Not knowing that she was sewing into her own future. Mm. And after some time, Elijah now asks his say, what? Let's talk to this woman. She must need something. I don't know that you can reach. You don't have to talk to me. Well, I need the governor to give me a contract to everything. I'm very uniform with you. But it's the boy, Elijah Spear now said, Ma, sir, this woman does not have children. Mm. Am I right? Yes, ma'am. And then, um, something happened. He made a pronouncement mm. that by this time next year you will have children. So, from this, 
can we analyze the logs that came out from this city, from this um, uh, scripture, this woman's story? Mm. There is a love of man, man to man, human being to human being. Love. So, my, you know, yeah, I, I think we are only we are really so on the discussion line. Yeah. The others are on the Facebook and the Instagram, so we will not be able to. Mm-hmm. Is my voice loud, you know? Yeah, your your voice is louder. It's good. Okay. So, they will not be able to contribute verbally. They will. They, will mm, they can. So yeah. Much yeah. To do the answering. Yes, uh, I want to say, okay, the love, the love of God. The woman showed the love of God, number one, by yeah. by inviting by inviting the man of God, you know, to to come and stay with him. And if we if we talk about it, if we relate it to what is happening, you know, in our uh, life these days. Uh, we we can see that it's not it's not easy. No woman will, will say, "Oh, let me let me bring the man of God, you know, to my home," you know. So I think the the woman loved the woman loved God too, and uh, I believe that her husband also loved her and trust her because she was the one that that initiated it. I, I, am I right? Hello. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, she was yes. the one that uh, felt that this man of God needed a place. And as the children of God, that is what uh, God expects us to do because he has given us a lot. So he expects us to share, to share the love of God with other people. I think I should rest my case. Amen. Amen. That's a good one. For our uh, daily for our present situation. Okay. You know, like she said, maybe some husbands will not like it, mm-hmm. but that we can provide accommodation in different ways. Absolutely. Either another place for the man of God to stay, or you pay for a hotel stay, mm-hmm. you know, or whatever he or she stay, anytime you come, sir, I'll be doing the booking, I'll be, I'll be sending your food to you. Mm. And this is not only for men of God alone. Although in those days you can do it, they said strangers come into your house. Mm-hmm. That you, you can call in strangers to come and stay with you when they are stranded. Yes. But the life that we are we are at, especially in Nigeria, for everybody is just being careful. But there are also ways, like I said, of going about it to show the love of Christ. Yes. Okay, take the fence. Oh, you are a man of God, you come here, oh. I'll give, take you out for dinner, mm-hmm. buy food for him. Or he has come, you know, his suit is always the same suit he's been wearing yes. for three years. He has been coming to that, that town. Mm-hmm. Get another outfit for him where you can afford it mm. and give to him. That is the love of God. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. You know, at times, even God may even demand some things from us. And we say, I remember Bishop Stone, was it two years ago? He just went to one of his um, sons in the Lord's Church, you know, unannounced. Okay. And when that one saw him, he said, you know, that you have to come to the front and all that. And maybe people demanded that he said something. So as he got to the altar to say something, the Lord said, those shoes of yours, give it to the drummer. And now these shoes are not ordinary shoes. Mm. <laughs> mm. They are like, you know, those kind of shoes are maybe two hundred pounds or something mm-hmm. from England. Mm. Mm. He was like, okay, now my shoes. So you know, and I now said, okay, drama because I should give you the shoes. The boy was going. You know why? Why? Because the day before, the boy and the pastor. They had talked about him getting a new pair of shoes. That is mm-hmm. some pastor in that church. Okay. To show that his shoes were in a temple state and he's a dedicated member of the church. Wow. So they, had, they were like, okay, maybe next weekend, mm. find a way of plant price shoes, you know, something like that. Okay. Now, I will call his name so that you will know because he went on the internet mm. that the priest was in the church that day. 
Remember that guy that is always uh, criticizing? I know that he frees. Uh -huh. And he went and blocked it. Put it in the blog and he said something like, ah, uh, he should that. Something like, see that the shoe are so expensive that they should have sold it and gotten money for this and that and that and that. So something like that. No unnecessary, just say the issue of unnecessary publicity. Mm. But that publicity became a positive one, I'm sure, after some time. Mm, okay. So there are times that God will tell God said, Yeah, yeah, and then we are killing the shoe there. And mm. so it was a testing in that boy's life. Mm. In that's life. And Thank not you. so many other people were there. But Thank to people you. that are antagonistic, he said it was a different story entirely. Wow. They did not help us to obey immediately because I know that God has done much more than that to be in the condition of even after that. Mm. So, mm. yeah, to obey, don't say if anyone had said, okay, this is summer, mm, okay, well, this is winter, okay, next summer I will, I will tidy that out so can make it nice. Mm. Oh, okay, this and But he did not do that. He did not do that. Mm. Rather, what he did was that he, she know that she went and she still did that thing, arranged that uh, article for the man of God to stay, mm. and that was the same room where her own child was faced back to life. So yes. Not help us to do Amen. 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 And Amen. I, in, in addition to what you said, it happened to one of my sons too, one of my spiritual sons. He went to Nigeria. So he attended a church with his uh, brothers and cousins. And at that church, he saw somebody. Uh, he saw this guy walking, you know, barefooted inside the church he was going. And he was still serving. The boy was going around and around. And he, he sized the, the boys up. You know, he kept on, you know, looking at him that, why should this man be walking, you know, in the church barefooted? At the end of the the service, he had the spirit of the Lord telling him, give him your shoes. Do you know before God and man, he took off his shoes, he went looking for the guy, and he gave him the shoes. <laughs> they, they were like, his cousins were like, are you crazy? And the, the boy said, no, no. He, he, in fact, he walked back, he walked uh, barefooted back to the to the car because they were like no we wouldn't do that with you you know and by the time he left nigeria come and see testimonies hey so it's always it's always good though to do the the things of god <laughs> hallelujah hallelujah especially when we are prompted uh, mm -hmm. good to obey. yes i yes. remember i went um Somewhere, me and another woman of God went to visit another woman of okay. God that had been in hardship. Mm. This man, this man was a friend of mine. So I said, Oh, that's a girl I like you. This is so bad. That was my first time of well, taking that man. Okay. Ah, la, 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 la. So, kept quiet. So I went to her kitchen and took a plastic bag. After we had talked and talked, she didn't know what I was saying. I put my, my stuff in the plastic bag and I gave her the bag. Hmm. She was so happy because <laughs> she had lost everything. Wow. So, the woman of God that went with me was just looking. Mm. After some time, she said, Please, can I have plastic bag? She said, Why? So I gave it to her. She did the same thing with her own bag. Oh, wow. <laughs> and she said, You know what? She said, When I did it, the Lord said, eh, What are you waiting for? Mm. Why can't you give your own as well? Wow. Look at, so look at, so look at, hey, this kind God. I know for me, oh, I've never laughed. Mm. Even as it's after them. They did not help us in Jesus' name. We should not hold them so dearly that we cannot give up. That's mm. just mm. the mm. the, the next one, number 13, is Neymar and his maid. I thought we discussed it last week. Yes, we talked about Neymar and his uh, maid last week. So we're okay. going to a big man's maid and her mistress. Oh, and her mistress, yes. So, yes. We talked about Naaman and his uh, maid and Naaman and his. Uh, we talked about both? Yeah, we talked about it uh, last week. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But when we uh, said that the the wife must be a, 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 a nice, good a, a good yeah. woman. 
to have okay. allowed uh, the maid to go and to even have listened to to our maid. All right. Okay. Yes, ma'am. That's true. So yeah. today we are, we are going to go to the um, the Pharaoh's Pharaoh's daughter and Moses. Okay. Exodus chapter two. So remember the story and please analyze it. Yeah, um, uh, it was uh, it was the time of uh, Herod when he he made a decree that uh, that they should be killing uh, male children, and uh, at that time, the oh what is uh, Moses' mother's name? I forgot right now. So she had a baby and she hid the baby because she saw that she, uh, the baby was a was a godly goodly good looking. You know, so I knew that she she had that um, God must have prompted her because physically she would not be able to have done that. So and I think she she how, how do I say this? Boyotin Shaw Atima Lossi that place Atima Atima Ronu the 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 woman will will have been thinking about oh my God how will I hide this boy? Or we cannot say as the children of God, I don't think anything is uh, coincidental. So, whatever it is, he, she hid the boy, she took, it, she took him to the river where the princess used to go and take a, a bath, right? And uh, mm -hmm. the, the princess saw this uh, good looking boy, ah, and she said, wow. This uh, this is one of the Hebrew boys. Let me just uh, to bring him home, and uh, I think it is the, the 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 love of God, the love, that love from the princess, because if she were to if not for love, I mean, he was a Hebrew boy, and uh, they they were looking to kill all of them. He should have been. She should have you know as the princess well, go and kill him because. He was a Hebrew boy. So but the Bible says he, he, she saw him, she saw the, the, that the boy was good. And uh, I think it has to do with the plan of God, you know, for him, because he was a destined, uh, destiny child. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And also, um, Moses' sister. Yeah. Takes love. Was Moses' sister that took the baby to the stream? Absolutely. And was watching, moving with the pastors as it as it went along. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It can be, I can be your sister. Was I may not be able to risk my life for you. Oh yeah. Mm. <laughs> that's it. That's so a big one. Happened. As that's woman a... saw her, she could say, behave both of them. Yeah. Yeah. So she showed love on that level. In, in addition to that, ma, uh, the love of a mother manifested in that uh, in that uh, scenario because it happened that the mother was the one who nursed her baby <laughs> hello yeah. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm, yeah yeah so uh, incidentally enough the mother had to nurse her baby even in the palace ah hallelujah <laughs> God is great. God is wonderful. Yeah. yeah. So we can we can put it in today's perspective. The great love I see there mm -hmm. is um, that uh, princess is not do too much. This is a princess. Whatever she says goes. Oh yeah. Which is uh, Marian, Moses' sister. That actually risked her life. Hmm. But she was the one that followed the basket. Yes. Even not the family. Because what happened was that the Bible says that when the when Moses went up could not hide her any hide him anymore. You know mm -hmm. babies they will cry, cry, cry first of all. Let me cry in this house. Ah. That was why she had to do what she had to do. Uh -huh. So the family too showed love by covering it up yes. for a while. Yes. Finally, uh, what's her name? Mariam Polly. Mm -hmm. How many of us? And they were standing, they were standing somewhere. They were still standing. Yeah, yeah, no, she was, she was Mariam in particular. Uh -huh. the yeah, no, the mother, um, okay. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. she could have said, Oh, 
take that money, I can't go to your town, go by yourself. <laughs> yes, so. I can give you an example. Mm. Mm. And I just pray that a lot of families will follow you because mm. I see a lot of families, they have fallen short of the brotherly love. That yes, so. Yes, so. Just like a. Uh, what is the polygamous song called that when we discussed it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. This family, all of them are in the US. Their father had passed, but their old mother is in the US as well. Oh, very old. And eventually she became seminally ill. And mm. come and seek care. Come and seek care. Mm. All these children are top place to mm. professors, doctors. The engineers, they are wow. not spontaneous people. Wow, thank you, Lord. Come and seek care. How? Okay, so initially they were passing her like every year, uh, every four months from one family to the other. After some time, they said, if I let's go to the bus, and then they would come. If that person is um, traveling, one of them will come over mm. and take care of the mother by mm. themselves. They, were, they had, they had um, nurses and everything. Wow. And also, that's what they're doing. I was, I'm always so impressed. Mm. And then when it's Christmas time, all of them now come over to this house where the mother is and spend Christmas with her oh. and blah, blah, blah. Oh, wow. Beautiful family. Then, uh, when she died, it was glorious. Mm. So, I, in the church, we were giving testing. We said we should keep testing. It was even me that started. And everybody now said, I'm going to keep. Mm. I talked about the future of the family. Somebody said something. She said, they had not, she had not seen the, it's, she, one of the sweet styles at last week. So, that one now came to New Jersey or New York, and she now saw her in the hospital. Like, she went to the hospital, so after five said, her, her brothers, one of her brothers' children is on admission, and they are going to do a procedure. Mm. This woman traveled all the way from another state. All of them, I know she was, as agitated as she would have been, if it would have been her own child. Hmm. At the end of the day, all of them met there. Hmm. Wow. All of the brothers and sisters, they were, they were at the theater door waiting. Ew. Wow. That is love. Hmm. Hmm. Meanwhile, in some families, this is my own you. In fact, they will even take what is your from you. I'm mm. playing, I'm mm. asking that please let us show love. Mm. The paper says charity begins at home. At home, then you. If you cannot love the person that you share the same, you share more blood mm. together with your sister and brother than even with your child. Mm. Because your child's blood is already mixed with your husband's blood. Absolutely. Uh, so your own blood is daddy and mommy, your sister's mm. blood is daddy and mommy. Mm. Show love. Mm. Love one another, show compassion. Yes. Somebody's uh, husband was in one family, the husband was being very, very sick, admitted, and people recently. And one of the sisters traveled to that state, to that city, to do something else. And she was asking, Do I need to come and see you? Can you imagine? Do I need to come and see you? See her sister. Even uh, if her sister is not good, even if her sister is Must she take good, permission before she goes? And after all, you be busy. Uh, what does that got to do with oh what we're God. saying? It shows there is no love. Mm. Mm. Yes, my grandmother taught me something, and it was on a different level. She taught me, she said, I was young, she said, she was talking about how her own father never did to do mm. African, African thing. Her father was a king. She never did to do. Why? He said, he said um, if they were breaking him, you are a king, but you need to protect yourself. He said, no, if this God cannot protect me, then too bad. Hmm. It's like because if I take the jewel of protection and put it in my house, so I get a negative spirit. And that negative spirit will attract every other juju in that area. Hmm. Now, for example, if this house is in number one, and one Babala one is sending juju to number 10. Okay. When the juju gets to number one and he sees his friend, his friend is protection, but he's still juju. Ah, this is where you are. How are you? Thank, thank you. If I can't finish talking, it's already morning. Oh my God! I cannot go. I'll be living here. Hey. So you can protect. Before mm. you know it, hatred has come. Before you know it, sickness, sickness, you has come. Mm. Before you know it, madness has come. And before you know it, you are accumulating. 
But my grandmother said something. She made she said that once a proverb just said she said we cannot go to the city where your blood sister or brother is, even if it is for business and not branch and greet. Mm, mm. Exactly. Mm. And so, so that thing is always in my head. Mm. Mm. And I know. So some people, my Bible says that there are some friends that stay closer than your than, than than your sister. siblings, than know. your blood uh, related them. Um, yes. Mm. I can't work. I had this first cousin. They are, they are, in fact, they are like my. They are even blood. Related. You see. When we first moved here, they were like, "Sister, we are coming. Sister, we are coming." One was in England. One was in the US. In the US. Mm. I'm in Houston. So when I wanna came one day to do the to do the I said, Well, but what's come and be sister? And I said, Okay, let's do a road trip. Mm. These people all the way from New Jersey drove all the way to just you? to see me wow. and my children and wow. they drove back. Ew. What kind of love is that? Jesus. Meanwhile, there are situations whereby somebody that is brother and sister is born. We now come and maybe come to maybe in New York or whatever, uh -huh. and not think, think of okay, let me I'm in America now, let me branch and maybe see my sister. Hmm. May the Lord help That's us. That's love. It's a challenge to every one of you. Yes. Everybody on this line. Mm. Your the same blood flows in, in your brother and your sister. Your Don't be a rival. Don't mm. be a, mm. a, a a what is what is a, what is again what is whatever it is that is not good mm. with your blood. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 So, once, me, me, although Miriam missed it later, but he, she did that work. Yes. She did not allow Moses to die. Mm -hmm. Men that broke, when she missed it, God had to reprimand her. Oh, yeah. Struck her leprosy. Hmm. Hmm. You know? Yes. You don't talk to anointed anyhow. Mm -hmm. So, the next one is the men that broke the rules. Yes. To bring down the. They are friends. That is a friend. Yes. Definitely, maybe the man, like we're saying, maybe we'll have a family, maybe mm. we'll have brothers and sisters that do not even bother. But oh, this one, I yeah. like it's a victim of their mm. been paralyzed for so many years. Mm. But his friend went all the way for him. Can you give examples of friends that go all the way? Oh, in real life. Real life. Friends that go all the way and friends that can do anything for you. The ones that when you, I, I have one here too. I, I have, um, I would say, two or three friends like that. That if, uh, uh, if like uh, the song that I remember, in my, like a mother, like sister, that uh, you're able to share with. You're able to share your, your life weight. You're able to share um, uh, everything. You know, you, you have friends that you, that you cry, that, that, that lends you ease or a shoulder to cry on, you know? So, in fact, I, I have my, oh, we don't have to, I can talk about um, at least two people. A friend of mine was even sharing with me that um, there was a woman who, who helped her when she was in need, when she was in need, that she, they, she thought, you know, the whole world was falling upon, upon her. But thank God she met this woman. I remember, ma, remember uh, uh, Reverend uh, Ethel Adiremi mentioned yeah. a friend a friend that uh, a friend in London that they can you know so we all have uh, friends like that you know at one time or the other so may the Lord give us uh, uh, great friends friends that can you know that can be there for you 24-7 that oh, and, and we pray that we will be there for our friends too I, we, I pray that people can you know nominate us you know as 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 great friends Amen. and they will not be tired yeah the real friends are the friends that they will be there and they will never be tired and they will never yes yes but this friend that did that one i'm sure they've been there from the beginning and they're not tired of helping mm -hmm. we are mm -hmm. let's go there 
Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I had a train, I danced back home, home, when I was in real distress, I was ill and everything. Mm. He said, ah, this one, I don't understand. And we're not, in those days, we were not, we're not mounted people. I said, mm. ah, no, 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 no. And she's going, you know, going to, was a uh, MFM that was the mountain then. She okay. went all the way from Lagos to MFM and camp. They had just mm. started the place was in the state then. Okay. Now, which is for me. Mm. And I look at myself, I'm saying, Yes, I can do video for my friends, but I will not go to mm-hmm. <laughs> camp that is still yes, eh? video with one to mm. But she did that. Mm. So I said, no, don't worry, I'll find my way there. If I, if I also cannot take her there, I said, she'll find her way. That's about, I'm over 20 years ago. Mm. Thank you, Lord. Some years ago, in five years ago, mm. when the place was still a real forest. Mm. Very mm. few friends can do that for you. Yes. And meanwhile, there are sisters or whatever that would not even do as if there's anything going on. Mm-hmm. The Lord help us to sustain. Amen. And the question is, what kind of prayer are you? Mm. Are you a fear weather prayer? Mm. That we just take and take and take and not give? Mm. Even when there's an older friend I have here, that if I cough like this, eh, mm. next day it's nothing on my door. You see? Or she would say, okay, ah, no, you have to go to the hospital. Okay, mm-hmm. but, okay, what do you want to do? Whatever you want to do, sort out. Mm-hmm. Then mm-hmm. you will help us in the first Amen. Amen. So, the next one, number 18, Nebuchadnezzar and Daniel. Mm. The, the Bible says that um, he loved Daniel because he did not sleep at night. Mm. <laughs> Daniel chapter 6. Yeah. Mm. He couldn't sleep. Yeah. Are you can let's read that thing to be sure of what you are reading. Can you open to Daniel chapter six and read that short okay. area for us? Starting from when they threw him into the den. Yeah, so they then okay. So what actually happened was that along ah. Bang Lodi Along Bang Lodi He was forced to make a decree. Yes. Everybody was out to his God. Yes. The chiefs, the other chiefs knew that mm-hmm. they, uh, Daniel would not bow. Mm-hmm. So they wanted to catch him that way. Mm-hmm. And really, Daniel did not bow, so they caught him. Yeah. So they don't have a choice mm-hmm. but to do what, what he had said he would do. But he could not speak. Mm. And I want to say what something, ma. I want to say something about Daniel too. Daniel loved his God, that he was ready to die for God. Okay. Okay. No, we are talk we are talking about Nebuchadnezzar. Uh, um, Daniel chapter six. Yeah, even more. What verse? We start from when after he had gone through I already given them the synopsis. He so after, after he had entered the den, the lion's den. Oh no. Let me start from 16. So the king gave the order and they brought Daniel and threw him into the lion's den. The king said to Daniel, May your God, whom you serve, continually rescue you. Mm. Oh, no, too bad. So that is love, too. Okay, yeah, can you imagine? A stone That's was. Br- <laughs> you want me to continue? Yes, ma'am. A stone was brought and placed over the mouth of the den. And the king sealed it with his own signet ring and with the rings of his nobles so that Daniel's situation might not be changed. <laughs> then the king returned to his palace uh-huh, and spent the night without eating and without any entertainment being brought to him and he but could he not sleep. He, he could fasted. not sleep. Eh? But then he fasted that night. Yes. Yes, he could not sleep. And fasting, the very first, mo- uh, the next morning, he was the first one to run, to hurry up to the lion's den. Okay. When he came near the den, he called to Daniel in an anguished voice. Look at something right there. In an anguished voice. He was troubled. Hmm. Remember, he already, he already prayed. 
that may the Lord you serve continually. Ah, may the Lord continually rescue us in the from the hands Amen. of our enemies in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So he, he, in anguished voice, eh, he was in anguished voice because he loved Daniel. He didn't want mm. Daniel servant not servant of the living God as your God whom you serve continually been able to rescue you from the lions. Checking continue anyway. Uh -huh. Next pastor, we talk. And my God sent his angel. No, 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 no. Daniel answered, Oh king, live forever. My God sent his angel and he shut the mouth of the lions. They angel. have not hurt me because I was found innocent in his sight. No, have I ever done anything wrong before you, O king? Eh? Ah. Hallelujah. Mm, hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So, we're talking about the love of man to man now. Yes. loves Daniel. You know? Even if he had died, had been somebody that he hated in your life. Uh -huh. He had to throw him to the dead. He said, I cut off his head, Joe. Uh -huh. <laughs> I would have done that. Cut off his head. Yeah. You know that hand of hand, then throw his body to the, the lions. Yeah, to the lions. Come, PCC. Oh, my God. Ah. Thank you, Lord. But then you pay all the chiefs and their family uh -huh. to them for the lions to have good dinner. Mm -hmm. mm. And, and so shall it be. Me. So shall it, it be. Conspiracy. Mm. Anywhere that is conspiracy mm. against children of God, mm. God will deal with them in several things. Lord God that Jesus. That's what the people conspiring against, against the, 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 the innocent child of God. Hey. So, at times, we have to be very careful, especially, you know, we are talking about the love of God between uh, families, friends, and the nation mm -hmm. and all that. Yeah. We have to be very careful. The Bible says you shall not be able to go through this. Mm. The Bible Bible does not like conspiracy. God does not like conspiracy. Mm. It is a an act of wickedness. Yes. When you know that the result of this thing is going to hurt that person or destroy that person, and you still con conspire, mm. you know something happened recently. I'm like, really? There's this family. The lot have been going on over the years. I decided okay, let's just have a meeting. And the person that was accused went into the family. You know, these are the kind of things I see in the Bible movies. Mm -hmm. I began to talk to some of the brothers. Some of them said no. Some of the members of the family. Some of them said, no, no, I don't want to part of that rubbish. So I was like, if she says this, you say that. You know? If the sister that is great says this, mm -hmm. you say this one. Mm -hmm. So they are saying that when the meeting started, they started forming stories that never happened. Mm -hmm. But thank God that there are no consequences. But I also thank God for the finish. The Bible says that it turns there. The, the, the enterprise of the wicked foolishness. Mm, into foolishness. It's very clear to everybody listening that uh, mm. this one, they have had a meeting before the meeting. Mm. Please don't be involved in conspiracy. Mm. Don't let anybody be like you. Mm. All the chiefs don't have to agree. It was not by force. No, no, no. But they conspired together. Mm -hmm. And you see, at the end of the day, their whole family was destroyed. Mm. Because at times, when you do that, it may not be, there will, nobody will throw you to the lion's den. But things will begin to happen in your home and begin to wonder why. Yes, so, yes. You put such a thing to an innocent person, mm -hmm. conspiring because somebody incited you. At the end of the day, you have done evil against your brother. Mm. And you know what happens? Then maybe, maybe you get to your wife starts to fight you. Or your children will fall and they go to hospital. Yeah. Or then yeah. you get to smoke, you go. Yeah. Now that we didn't know what happened. Those are they have opened an a, 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 an edge. Hmm. For the serpent. Uh, the serpent, aha. Open an edge. For the evil baby. Hmm. Don't do anything evil against your against brother. Against anybody. Hmm. Any human being. Yes. In church too, it happens. It happens everywhere. You know, everywhere. My plan. Yeah. My scheme. Mm. The Lord help us with Jesus. Amen. Amen. So Esther and the eunuch is the next one. Esther, the the niece of niece of Mordecai, the gate man, the Jewish gate man of the mm -hmm. king. Yeah. Yeah. Who very good obeyed her um, uh, her foster father, did everything. Mm -hmm. Eventually she became queen yes. in Bashi's And but before she became queen, they had to undergo some 
from like beauty treatment for I think for some years or was it for a short period? For training. The Bible says that Esther had favor. Mm. Can you please read Esther chapter two, mm. starting from verse mm. eight? Mm -hmm. The eunuch does not know Esther. Mm. He was not Jewish. Mm -hmm. He was nothing, nothing. But God gave the love of God was shared abroad in his heart mm. to be able to, you know, help Esther to get the best of the best. Mm. Okay. Esther two. Verse eight. When the king's order and edict had been proclaimed, many girls were brought to the citadel of Susa and put under the care of Agai. Esther also was taken, taken to the king's palace and entrusted to Agai, who had charge of the harem. The, the girl placed him and won his favor. Hallelujah. Immediately, he provided her with her beauty, treatment, and special food. Wow. He assigned to her seven maids selected from the king's palace and moved her and her maids into the best place in the harem. Continue. Mm -hmm. Esther had not revealed her nationality and family background. <laughs> oh, because Mordecai had forbidden her to do so. Every day he walked back and forth near the courtyard. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How about chapter verse 15, rather? Okay. 15 or 16? 1 5. When the turn came for Esther, the girl Mordecai had adopted, the daughter of his uncle Abihail, Abihail to go to the king, she asked for nothing other than what Eger, the king's Enoch, who was in charge of the harem, suggested. And Esther Hallelujah. won. Amen. And Esther won the favor of everyone who saw her. She was Hallelujah. taken to King Zerzes in the royal residence in the tenth month, the month of Tibet, in the seventh year of his reign. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. So she got she had favor yes. in the eyes of the you know. Yes. I want to single her out. Out of mm. the menu. Mm. There were hundreds of them. I can't remember. Ah, Father, sing us out in the name of she Jesus. She had table. Mm. He, he just loved her. He good thing that he was a eunuch. You know, he was supposed to speak with her. Mm -hmm. He not have been castrated. He don't have yeah. been made to speak. Mm -hmm. But he just singled her out mm. and we tabled her. Mm. Anywhere we go, we singled her for tables. He was singled us out in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Amen. 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 Amen.
God wants us to show love without, you know, with no strings attached. Yeah. Because he gave us Christ. He gave, he gave us, you know, his only begotten son. It is because he loved us. And yeah. he still loves us. God will have mercy on us. Amen. And that's something we need to tell our men, especially as they are passing through this um, mm -hmm. broadcast. Yes. yes. God has given you something extra in women. Mm. Try, if you are attracted or you are attracted to women, that is a form of health. You know, a lot of them, their problems, they cannot separate erotic love from the agape love. Absolutely. They find it so difficult. Everything mm -hmm. is required yeah. from their head to their loins. Mm -hmm. That's how it works. Yeah. And that's so, right. as men of God, you have to fight it. Mm. You have to fight it. Yes. You have to, you know, physically fight the negative attraction that mm -hmm. you have to any female gender that is around you that, or yes. that comes around you especially for help. Mm. You see, when somebody is vulnerable hmm, in a um, psychological deep, when a woman is in a vulnerable position, mm -hmm. a man passing by, both men, they have this compassion. Mm. Now, if they're not careful, the compassion will develop into uh, just ordinary, you know, lost. Mm. They'll give you money, even the money they cannot give their wives or their children. They give to, yeah, yeah, that's what happened. And they want, initially, they want, they want to help sincerely. Mm. But if you cannot hold that thing, mm. you can't, you can use it against them. Yes, and so. they will not, you know, yes. who what they should not do with the woman. Exactly. Or even, they will force the woman and mm -hmm. make them yeah. Mm -hmm. But initially, it started with a good mind. Yes. So, you need to be very careful. Mm -hmm. When you are helping somebody, I say, man, help that person. Please, especially when the person is vulnerable. Mm -hmm. You know, I tell my daughters, don't ever cry on the man's shoulder. Mm -hmm. Don't. Because it doesn't make a difference. They don't understand our language. Mm. Amen. That's Amen. all I did. Even the ones who are there are some crying. Somebody just a very close auntie, like a mother to her, and she was crying so much. You know, ah, la, 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 la. I saw her last time. Another kind of weeping and weeping, mm. and the other was consoling her, consoling her. And you know that the mom, in the process of consoling, the mom wanted to. <laughs> I know, but I I have a story like that too. Married uh, man, that yeah. um. So you don't cry on a man's shoulder. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Don't go to your professor's office and cry. Yeah. Because of the man, the man that you lost down yourself. And, and they're that, asking for trouble. The woman can control herself more than a man. Mm -hmm. So please, as you're listening to this podcast. Yes. But you need to you need to put up a strong face and go and cry in the corner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and don't be leered. Don't be leered. Men too need to know that do you do not have to be leered by the by the whims and you know of the women cry, crying on your shoulder. Don't be leered. Do you because, know that? Uh -huh. there, are lots, there are lots of stories about yes. Let's say there are, there are couples, two couples there eh, that mm -hmm. are very close friends, mm -hmm. and maybe the husband of one dies. Yeah. And because they are the closest friends, the husband of the other is always like, okay, let's take uh, they, they take food. Everybody, yeah, everybody's friend, yeah. There they was a good first up. Mm. Eventually, the, the man will now end up marrying the other woman. Can you imagine? The one I'm, I was trying to talk about. And they, so compassion to something else. You see? This woman eventually had a baby for, yes. for, for, yes. for the man. The man yes, and the woman that. knew the woman started warning her husband that no, this is getting too close. Oh, let us help her now. Ah, uh, why, why now? Let us help her so much so that the other woman will be going to the office to meet this man. The, the other woman had baby for him. The yes. home, the home almost uh, Dabaru Patapata. So, Amen. God, we have mercy on us. Soon. 
women, and we have just two, three more, so let's hurry up nine. Joseph of Arima Tires, he was the one that um, went and asked for Jesus' um, um, body. Yes. And was going to go and bury him mm-hmm. by himself in his own personal tomb. Yeah. So that's love. Yes. That's his love. Um, yeah, that is love. People just almost similar to the to the uh, to the woman. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I uh, help Elijah. Yes. Know, yes. He just give give accommodation to those who he even gave accommodation mm-hmm. to the dead. Yes. Now Rahab and the spies. Okay. Yeah. Rahab also did the same. She gave accommodation to the to the spies, and she got rewarded for what she did. So her name has been written in the in the book of the Lamb. So as the children of God, God wants us to to help to give accommodation to whoever. But um, uh, at this time, uh, in in this uh, our age, we we need to we need to do what God has called us to do. But at the same time, we need to seek the power of the Holy Spirit before we. Because I know of uh, some people who accommodated people, and it led to serious uh, wahala. Yeah. 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 We need to like um, talk to God about it before. We yes. Do. Yes. Seek That's the why we all, we all need the Holy Spirit. The, yeah. Even, even at times, God Himself will come to do this. Mm-hmm. And, you know, if you are used to hearing God's voice, you know it's in God's voice. And then, if not, if you want to be by yourself, just go to write it personally. Mm-hmm. Like, say yes for you. Yeah. And then go ahead and do what you need to do. Yes. We all need the power of the Holy Spirit to guide us yes. in, in any decision, not whether major or minor. We need the power of the Holy Spirit to guide us. Amen. Amen. Okay. Amen. The last one. Yes, the woman with the alabaster oil. Mm. Mm. That was Emery, remember? Yes, yes. Another lady. Yeah. So a woman came to him with an alabaster jar of very expensive perfume mm-hmm. and poured on his head as and was sitting uh, at the table. Mm-hmm. Mm. And then uh, Jesus said, uh, For what she had done, because she showed love. Love yeah. to Jesus. So saw this, this, I was reading I said verse twenty, verse eight. Oh, okay. When you saw this, they said this is a waste. Mm-hmm. Yes. Why this waste, especially um Judas? Mm. The perfume could have been sold at a high price and given to the poor. Mm-hmm. And aware of this, just said, "Why are you burning this woman? She's done. She has done a beautiful thing." To yes, me. absolutely. The poor will always have you have, mm. but you will not always. Um, yes, amen. amen. And also, there's something I learned from that last verse. Let me throw it back to you. Okay. Paul will always have with you, but you will not always have me. Can you say that again? The poor, the poor people, uh-huh. somebody said, go and why, why can't that? They said that uh, the alabaster oil was more than a year's wage. Yes, that it was very expensive. Now, so Jesus now said, you will always have a poor with you, but you will not always have me. Hmm. 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 That Jesus was telling us that, well, now that I'm here, do what I ask you to do, because I will soon be out of here. So, well, let them um, take the advantage. Take the advantage of me being with you. Do what I ask you to do. And get rewarded for it. Okay. Can we relate it to, uh, you know, see it as an advice that Jesus is giving us even today as we are talking? Yes. The poor will always be with you, but I will not always be with you. Okay, let me say. Prioritizing your giving. Mm-hmm. Give to the poor. No. Prioritize your giving. Jesus not say give to the poor, just say give to him first in this situation. Mm-hmm. 
prioritize your giving. There are times in the time in your life when you are torn between, you know, maybe you have twenty dollars to give, and you are torn between two ways to pay. Mm. Jesus is saying, prioritize it. Look at which one should I give? Do me first. Uh-huh. Do no. Jesus first. Don't give Jesus first. Food. That's what I was saying. What he's saying is that he said before we always have. This. Okay. He's saying he's not seeing himself as God at that point, point in time because he has related to them as men. Oh, okay. What I think he's saying is this: when you have that thing to do, hmm. you have to prioritize. Okay. For example, let me let me. I think I should use a good example. You have an aged mother, hmm. ninety-nine years old. Okay. And you have this cousin, twenty-five. That's always coming for money every time. Hmm? Mm-hmm. And this ninety-nine-year-old woman needs money. Mm. Who will you give it? Ah, the old woman, no. Exactly. So that is how it is. Yeah. So what is telling us that when we are doing our giving, even mm. if we not here, mm-hmm. or we, we have to give with wisdom. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Time. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, giving somebody else, from your family, somebody that you do not know, mm. whatever you have to do, that person with wisdom. Mm. Yeah, but when you are actually told what to do, then even if it does not seem wise, if God has been to you to do it, do what God has told you mm. to do. Yes. Amen. May the Lord help us Jesus' name. Amen. 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 You know, it's very important that we listen. Holy Spirit. There are even times that God will say, give so and so this person, this thing. Yes. And that person will use it badly. Mm-hmm. You know, you know there are some people that they don't like to take. I used to be like that before. Mm. But please try me now. I will <laughs> take and I will take. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot give you anything if I will not take. Uh-huh. Mm. Very bad, prideful way. Yeah. So there are some people like that. That God will say, get up and go and give so and so something. And mm-hmm. that person will get there and that person will refuse it. Mm, mm, mm. Hey, go. Just Pick do it. it. Just obey. Obedience is uh, is what Jesus wants us to do. Just exactly. obey and and let go. Yeah. Mm. May the Lord make God us. Uh, may, may the Lord make us best givers in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Mm. Amen. Remember one question in one of the. Uh, you remember your more program that we had okay. when somebody said, uh, for your future, uh, is this good to be friends with somebody that you are not of any benefit, that is not of any benefit to you? Mm-hmm. And the answer was, why can't you seek to be of benefit to somebody? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Why should you always seek? Because that is the training of the world. Absolutely. But if you pray that you cannot be of, you cannot steal, no. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. God wants us to show love, mm. no matter what. Mm. A poor man can show love to a rich man. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, but I, I went to go and that, that way, I went to go and expose that thing to the king. So when he was poor, the king was very rich. Mm-hmm. Look, at, just, uh, look at these people that are using us as slaves. Let them kill each other. Maybe the next one will be better person. But he still went and did it. Mm. So oh. anybody that you have the power to do good for. That is your neighbor. And you can not see what banikma lati she run law of oh no len ike jire to jure. So that's how it is. That is that is your neighbor. Mm. And at times these things go back and come back. Yes, so especially in this day and age, mm. there is a lot, they call it karma, there is a lot of coming back that happening. Yes, so I'm telling you, I have experienced it, mm. and I'm like, really, God, you are great. He does not go foul. Thank you, Lord. Do something for somebody's Thank child, you, Jesus. somebody will do the same thing for your child. So, whether mm. good or bad, mm. so let us choose good, mm. let us be good to people, let us be good to our mates. For those of you that just beat your mates, anyhow. Mm. That's your okay to be a bodyka that can save you from death. Mm. If it's somebody that maybe your in-laws come and they put the key your food and you say, no, my madam was not die. But if you are a wicked madam, mm. that's it. Because mm. she will help them to put it. Mm. Or she will or she will be on your on your soup. Mm. Some of us are so wicked. 
we feed them until they are saved. Mm. We, we eat and we give the bones for them. As they if, are the ones that go to the market, they cook, they do everything. Mm. Why would they steal? As if tomorrow will not come. That means, you know. Yes. Why would they steal your stuff? Mm. When they are seeing all these things passing and you're not even giving them to you. Mm. They are human beings. Mm. Some maids, they are made to eat only once a day. God, we have Let us, your nose. Let us mm. show love. Mm. And may God help us in Jesus. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Let's begin to pray. Let's begin to ask God that everything that we have learned, Father, Jesus, Father two we weeks, thank you. In two weeks now, ah, two weeks of Father, different Father, sessions, Father. two and a half weeks. Yes. So that's the half of the month gone. Mm. Everything that we have learned with concerning God, Almighty God. God. Father, let it be permanent. Let it, let, let it be used for, for that's your what kingdom, God Almighty God. God. So we go into in the, the name of Jesus. To show that love to in the people. name of Jesus. You have showed us they love. Have seen a few the grace to show love. The grace to be a great example. Yes, God, my Father, my God, God, give unto us in the name of Jesus. The grace to, to be yeah, for and, those of and, us that are jealous of our siblings. Uh, ah, mm. she's not really under you, or you can play football better. Mm. Or my you don't know, have siblings because one is taller than the other is a problem. Yes, my junior brother is taller than me, then that's a problem for some people. Mm. Ah, I don't understand human beings. But I cast this evil thing out from anybody that is passing through this. Mm. Uh, 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 broadcast. Yes. Today, next, yeah. tomorrow, in the 50 years time. I cast out every spirit of civil rivalry. Rivalry is the most dangerous rivalry. That is the fight of the blood. Yes. It's ah, always yeah. terrible. It mm. is deep. Yes. My father, my lord, anybody that is coming out of, of this, they are going to hear this, O Lord. Father, I pray, O Lord, if they are ever in this, Father, I count it in their lives in Jesus' name. For those of us that are experiencing it, I feel, Lord God Almighty, that the man you gave their own children, soon then, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, that you, Lord God, God Almighty, will shed his blood, even into the lives of this. Rival, these people that have come, these sisters and brothers have come themselves to rivals in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Heavenly Father, we give you all the glory. Precious God, we give you all the honor. Thank you, God, we give you all the adoration. Father, thank you. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name. Father, we Amen. thank you for the Kana ministry. Thank you, Lord. Thank you because the gates of hell will not thank be very Thank you for thank every you, member Lord. of our regular Bible study. Thank, thank you, for Jesus. Thank, thank you for the staff. Thank, thank, thank you for the other mommy that comes. Thank you, thank thank you for Jesus. the Reverend. Thank Father, we give you all the glory for your lives in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you because, Lord, this Bible study, oh Lord, is all places in Jesus' name. Thank you for all our people on the broadcast tonight. In the name of Jesus. Thank you for thank you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. Lord, we thank you for Zoom. We thank you for Facebook. We thank you for Instagram. We thank you for Facebook. We thank you for all the social media and news. Thank you. Thank in Jesus you, name. Almighty God. At this point in Jesus time, Father Lord, I I destroy the powers of anti-Christians. You know, Christians are the ones that are anti-Christians. They're the ones that they are Christians. They're the ones that will post blog of a pastor to his wife. They're the ones that will post the blog of a pastor to his wife. There are many I've never seen in chat. Muslim whatever have ever seen that they have bought something and they said, I just had like the mom did this, this, that. They will not do that. They are loyal, but we mm. something yeah. else, and most of it is jealousy. Yes, God, we have mercy. And one that I will still prophesy of uh, 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 somebody using jets to carry people to hell. Can you imagine? He directly said to the Lord, have that mercy. That means that has a jet. So to carry people to hell. They just see all sorts, and it's due to that of God. Yeah. And their churches will not grow because uh, any church that there is no love cannot grow. Mm. So Father, I say, let your love your shed love. abroad in these your people's hearts. In the mighty name. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Amen. Ah. Father, we thank you. Thank you for your daughter that you have used for us tonight. Thank you for every one of us on the broadcast. 
Thank you, because this will bless us mightily, and we will be the agent of change, agent of transformation that God has called us to be in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, we want to thank everyone for being with us. Please, we like you to share so other people can benefit from this. This is deep. And remember, God is deeper than the deepest. And I'm sure that by the grace of God, we will come back again and uh, with another juicy, juicy, powerful uh, topic that will bless us. Amen, somebody. Thank you all as uh, we have come to the end of this broadcast tonight. Thanks for being part of this. Uh, God bless you. God keep you. God will cause his face to shine upon you. And we pray for our mommy. We pray that uh, the, the love of God will continue to radiate in your life. You will Amen. manifest the love of God. You will Amen. showcase the love of God. And your Amen. voice will be heard all over the world for the kingdom Amen. of God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we just want to thank you. And uh, we bless your holy name. As we go to sleep tonight, we will not sleep the sleep of death. We will Amen. wake up, you know, we will wake up energetically and uh, with your spirit guiding us in the name of Jesus. And we will say tomorrow morning, great is thy faithfulness, because you are our keeper forever and ever. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All our programs remain the same. Monday Bible study, we have done the one tonight. Friday Bible study, the same time, 8 o'clock. Thursday is our prayers for all the nations of the world. So please join us. And uh, and Saturday morning is uh, Destiny Matters and your mom. Yoruba version. Tuesday, 12 to 1 is Destiny Matters, uh, English version. Join us, and our life will never remain the same. Once again, uh, my name is Pastor Princess Adenike Akurede, our teacher, our mommy for today. Agbatelu, it's one your mom, you can me. I will not your name, the one and only mommy, Pastor Engineer Abimbola Akins. God bless you all, and shall we share the grace? Any any other thing? Ma? No, ma. Okay. So, praise, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shall we share the grace and uh, we, we give God uh, praises as we close for tonight. And the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit, rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely God's goodness and his mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 God bless you all. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Where's a video me allow where are you? So we can close with you. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Okay. God bless you all. Ugo Hallelujah, somebody. Bye. God bless you, our people. Good night.